Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay with us. We'll have all the action for you live right here on EA TV. Hello and welcome. This is a stadium that really resonates with every Australian football fan. We're in Sydney at Stadium Australia. I'm Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And it's match day one in the group stage for these two nations here at the 2023 Women's World Cup. It's England against Denmark. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. The England first 11. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. And the starting lineup for Denmark. Well, it's the same formation, but they use it to press the ball high up the field. And rarely do the wide players drop deep to defend. And watch out for the midfield three who continually rotate their positions. And so the battle commences. Promising looking ball. Must score! And it goes! That will do nicely for starters. First goal of the game. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing. What a goal. moving again what sort of response will we see from them now and an astute piece of defending San Trulsgård now let's see what they can do here but quick thinking defensively Plenty of support here. Useful looking ball. Well, they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Pernille Harder. And this situation could be dangerous. Well read to win possession back. And blocked for now. 
That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. Kira Walsh. Oh, big chance. Oh, it's in. A two-goal cushion now. And the lead fully merited. Well, let's take another look. And it's a very good goal. And they deserve it, you have to say. They've been excellent. Underway. Did well to win the ball back. Throw in for Denmark. Now, can she pick out a teammate? Corner given. And played short. Pernille Harder. On to Madsen. Gevitz. Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Can they take advantage of the situation? And it's played into the center. Well, shielding the ball admirably. And giving the ball away. Chloe Kelly. Chance here. A goal! And it seems they're truly cruising to victory here. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. Goal. On with the action. It's been all England so far. You sense there could be extra punishment in store. Baba. Well, not giving the opposition a look in. That's strong play. Well, that's the end of that move for now. Well, England have controlled possession, as you can see, and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. Yes, it's so true. For once, they find themselves in defensive mode. And given away. Svava. Daly. What a shocking pass, really. Oh, a nice looking pass. The inside route looking promising and saved by the keeper and they will make the change now
Who can they pick out? Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. Well, the fans want her to take on the shot. And a wonderful diving save to deny the opportunity. Well, opting for the short corner. And beating her opponent. And possession lost by England. Promising sequence. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. The first half here comes to an end. And so the battle commences. So off and running again here on the back of a dizzying first half performance by England. Can they produce more of the same in this half? Did well to win the ball back. Free kick awarded then by the referee. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Using her considerable strength to shield the ball. A bit sloppy in possession. Plenty of support here. Well, able to close down the short. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, the referee has decided that the injury is sufficiently serious for play to be stopped. Treatment required. Not a drop ball after the injury situation. And no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper. Nicolina Sorensen. They've regained possession. Dangerous looking through ball. Soon. And Walsh. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. And this time it's in! Fabulous goal. And just look at the celebrations. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. But I think the keeper's made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it should go in at that near post. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Stanway. Could be troublesome. Chance here. Oh, there it is. It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance.
Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. My goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. Gevitz. Sander Trulsgaard. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Bronze. It's a weighted pass. Well clattered away. Trying to really get at the opposition here. It's a perfect challenge. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Palmed away by the keeper. Couldn't quite hang on. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Well, those stats back up what we've been watching. It's been a really one-sided game, and it's far too easy for them to open up this defence. This could turn into a rout. Yes, they're having a field day in attack, and here they come again. Now well, the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick. And they're making a change. And deep into the penalty area. And a goal here. Accuracy with the header. Just what they needed. Well, here's the replay. And what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed. And it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Glut of goals, 5-1 it is. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Seveke. San Trulsgaard. Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. Seveke. Oh, great defending. Kira Walsh. Lauren Hemp. Well, visionary passing. Well, she should be a bit cross with herself. Couldn't test the keeper. And take it away. Seveke. And a good looking pass. An important interception. Daly. Stanway. Well, she keeps moving. Chance to finish. Brilliant crisp and clean tackle. Can they survive? And the referee has decided to add on three additional minutes.
Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Snelle. Sorensen. And the final whistle is sounded. England victorious. Plenty of plus points. And Stuart, your analysis. Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. Kira Walsh. Oh, big chance. Oh, it's in. A two-goal cushion now. And the lead fully merited. Chloe Kelly. A goal! And it seems they're truly cruising to victory here. And Walsh. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. And this time it's in! Fabulous goal! And just look at the celebrations! Could be troublesome. Chance here! Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of their performance.